This is Mohamedou, just one of the growing number of children living on the streets. Mamadou collects iron scraps and tin cans. He sells them for local merchants, making no more than 50 cents a day. He uses this money to buy what little food or glue he can. <laughs> Mamadou and his friend Abu Rashid are inseparable. The two can often be found in a public service center sponsored by the Niger government, UNICEF, and its partners. For many street children, centers like these serve as their sole support structures. This is Asumeni Yakuba, a Sejub youth worker. He has been working with Mamadou for two years and is hopeful that one day he will be glue free. For the moment, what we are trying to do is to make sure that they don't have to take the call because it's all their problem. There are others among them who have diminished this crisis of the call. We have two. We have the hope. For Mamadou and many other children living on the streets of Agadez, organizations like Sejup may be their only hope of breaking free from a life of poverty and addiction. This is Oscar Brett reporting for UNICEF. For more information, go to unicef.org.